Hi, I'm Cody with MailChimp. In this video, we'll go over how to view and understand your email campaign report. After you've sent a regular email campaign, you'll soon want to check out your report to see how it's performing. Your campaign report includes data on opens, clicks, social activity, e-commerce purchases, and more. With all this information, you can make better decisions for your marketing. There's a lot to go over with campaign reports, so let's dive in. To view a report for an individual email campaign, I'll click the campaigns icon and click reports. Since I have more than one audience, I'll select the one associated with the campaign I wish to view. Notice that I'm on the campaigns tab. This is where MailChimp provides a list of reports for various campaign types, including emails, automations, and landing pages. I have a paid plan, so I can also check out the comparative tab to create reports that compare the performance of one email campaign to another. And since I have a website, I can click the website tab to find data on visits, clicks, and subscribes. But for now, let's return to the campaigns tab. Here I have the option to filter by campaign status or type or organize my campaigns into folders. Since I'm looking for a regular email campaign, I'll click the emails filter. This brings up an overview chart with a timeline of open and click rates for all my email campaigns compared to the industry average for open rates. And after I've set up conversion tracking in Google Analytics, I can click the revenue tab to see how my campaigns are driving purchases on my online store or website. All right, now I'm gonna scroll down to my most recent email campaign. And here it is, with a summary of some key stats that I can hover over for more details. I wanna take a closer look, so let's see what my options are here. I can click view report, or I can click the drop down and choose to share the campaign, view the email, share the report, download the report, or print the report. I'll click view report. The first thing I see is this overview page. It starts off with some basic details like numbers of recipients, the subject line, when it was delivered. I can also view the email campaign as well as download, print, or share it. If I look further, I'll begin to see some key highlights like the order revenue for the store that's connected to my account. If I scroll down a little more, I can see my click performance. It shows the top URLs from my campaign. And if I click view click maps, I can see a visual representation of how each link performed. Next is my campaign benchmarking report. Here I can see how this email campaign measures against my average email campaign. I can also compare it to the average performance of peers in my industry. Looks like this one did pretty well. In this next section, I can see details like my open and click rates. This kind of data can help you make smart and informed decisions about what to do next to grow your business. And here, I can see some predicted demographics. This is a data science feature that guesses the gender and age of your contacts, so you can identify key characteristics of your audience and is available for select plans can also view how my campaign performed over the last 24 hours and learn which subscribers opened the campaign the most. If I scroll through the graph here, it looks like I had the most opens at this time. The social performance section provides a bird's eye view of how well it's performing on social media platforms like Twitter. And finally, I know where in the world my recipients are opening their emails based on their geolocation data. If I scroll back up to the top, I'll see additional tabs and menus that offer a deeper dive. For example, I can click the activity menu to view recipients by how they interacted with our campaign. Click the click performance tab to view how well each tracked URL performed. Click the social tab to check out top refers or click the e-commerce menu to review purchase activity and order history. I can also go straight to my inbox where I can view and respond to messages from my audience or click Analytics 360 to see Google Analytics data. And that's it. You've learned how to view and understand email campaign reports. For more information about reports, check out MailChimp's guides and tutorials.